Hello everybody. Today I have got a change request for creation of the purchase order document. CR document. They say it as CR document. Change request process. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a purchase order document. NL, NB. And with the number range, they have asked for the number range 9000002011 to 9000004010. Let me go to the live system and I am going to show that where I am going to create it. This is my system. Okay, go to SPR. SAP reference IMG. Go to federal management. Go to purchasing. Go to purchase order. First, I am going to create number ranges. See here, number ranges. IMG activity, click on to IMG activity. Intervals, click on to add. Now, X1. Okay. Enter the from 2. From is this, 9000002011. 2 is 4010. 4010. 4010. Okay, 9000004010. Press enter and save it. Okay, now let me come back. I'm going to create a purchase order document. Go to define document type. Position NB. It's my position. Take NB document, standard document. Select onto this, copy as. Okay. This is my NLNB. NLNB is my document type. NLNB. Okay. Purchase order, PO, NL, NB. Okay. What's my number range is X1. It's my number range. Press enter. Copy all. Copy all. Next. Now save it. Continue. See here. NL NBS come. So this is my purchase order, new purchase order. Let me create purchase order, do goods result and do invoice, vendor invoice. Go to ME21N. NL NBP. So this select out of this NL NB. NL NB. Where it is? Let me go here. Come back. Go to MB21 here. Standard versus order NL and B. It's not available. Depend on the time. Let's check it. NL and B. Available. Item category is available. Standard. Available. Everything is available. NLN. PO NLN. Sorry. PO NLN. See here. PO NLN. Let me create vendor. Let me enter vendor. Let me create a purchase order. Let me check. Purchase organization double one double one. Enter the material. Double two one. PO number quantity ten. Plant enter the plant. Enter storage location. Save it. Save. Let's check the CF. This is my purchase order number. So they were asking for this one. Number which. Now I will do goods receipt. Let me do goods receipt and invoice. Go back. Go to MIG. Enter purchase order number. Item OK and post. Let me do. Now let me do invoice certification. Vendor invoice. Go to MIR. MIR. Enter invoice date. 
enter tax tax code calculate tax enter po number see this is the amount 1 2 1 2 3 2 0 enter baseline date and post so it is working fine i have created so i have created po document number po document and with the number range this is a change request i have got it to it so i have shown you how to do it thank you thank you very much